Hey, happy Friday 13th to you in the year 2018. <laughs> it's now 9.19 p.m. and we're going to start off with Saturn because we're having a hard time working against that tree over there. It's funny, it's difficult for me to adjust things now because I took the dual camera thingy off. And uh, Saturn's not coming out near as well as I'd like. But there she is. She, he, it, whatever. Okay, finally, now we can get it coming up from the bottom. But still not liking it. And doggone it. Now, last night I did uh, get footage, but I didn't have a 2x teleconverter on. So I was quite unhappy with the footage. I wanted a closer look. But anyway, so there's Saturn. The best we can get it in, darn it. <laughs> in the southeast sky. Okay. Now we'll get out of Mosquito Haven and head on over to Jupiter, which is up over that away, which I have to move the whole kit. Okay. Phew. Yeah, lugging around 30 pounds of kit is getting to me. <laughs> okay, that's funny. Hmm. What's funny is I just checked before I came out and there was only three of the moons of Jupiter showing. I thought Ganymede would have been on the back side of Jupiter. We wouldn't be able to see it, but it's supposed to be Callisto bringing up the rear, but hmm. I'll have to double check. Okay. There is our Jupiter. Let's see if it's just scooting sideways or heading down. I think it's... Hmm. The last couple nights it's been heading down. Do I have it zoomed in? No. Hmm. There, okay, yeah, it is going down. Yeah, I don't think the skies are the best. I think there's some uh, mid or high level clouds or else we'd get it in better, I'm sure. Well, I'm not sure, but <laughs> I would hope. Yeah, just a bit too uh, blurry for me. Oh, wow. Well. Such a pretty planet. I know folks that have telescopes, they get the Saturn and Jupiter and great. But that's the best we can do with this Canon 80D and the Tamron 18-400 lens and the teleconverter and digital zoom and all that good shit. Oh my. <laughs> Alright, so there's Jupiter in the uh, south. We already got Saturn in the southeast. And now to head over to Venus for a quick look. Now Venus has had a partner, I'm not sure how long now, but Regulus has been close by. Last night it was at the four o'clock position, but they were spread pretty far apart. I can barely make it out, but I see it there. Yeah, it's barely flickering through, but it's right there. Now the crescent moon after the sun went down it was about one percent illuminated but I have too many obstacles in the way so I wasn't able to capture it or just like I can't get mercury the houses and trees are in the way for me in that direction so and I always have trouble getting Venus in. I just can't dial it in as good as some folks can. But there's our wandering star blob 
fallen. And yeah, it's not this dark outside, but when you use a teleconverter, you lose a couple stops of light with it, so. And I already have the ISO up to grainy level, <laughs> which I don't like, but there it is. So that's the west for Regulus and Venus. And we can't even make out the tree at that ISO. My goodness. That's ridiculous. That's one reason why I don't like using a teleconverter. I love being able to zoom into the planets, but but you lose too many stops of light. You can't even see anything out there. Alrighty. <laughs> well, I might as well shut this off and have a look-see at it. Alright, so it's uh, 9.38 p.m. right now. It's going to be a quick night, I guess. Okay, we can't see it very well. Maybe I'll put the still picture in, but over here in the southeast, we have Mars coming up. Um, it's now 11.22 p.m. on Friday the 13th. Okay, I did take the teleconverter off, so that's as big as we can get it in. Yeah, and just a blurry orange planet there. <clears throat> that's not coming out very well, is it? And the trees are going to take it out. It's having the same issue as Saturn does. And it can't move any further back because of the uh, fence, so that's going to have to do it. Saturn's over where Jupiter was to the right of that willow tree, and Jupiter's over by that house in the southwest. And Venus is gone. <laughs> She's gone for the night. And that should wrap it up for now. Alrighty, I hope you all had great viewing wherever you are and beautiful weather and, and all is right in your life. Take care now. Good night.